So hello guys, it is Monday, so it's time for another Power Query video. In today's Power Query video, I'm going to show you two things. I'm going to show you how you can insert text in a column without adding a new column. And I'm going to show you how you can have um, or, or the Power Query user interface help you write M code. Are you ready? Let's get started. Okay, guys, so this is what I have. I have a column that has 12, 14, 32. It's a duration column, so it is months. And I want to add the text months to this. So if you don't know any M, you can actually do this by going to add column, custom column. And then you can put um, duration and then concatenate it, right, with the word months. Once you've done that, you can just get rid of the first column and then you're good to go. But these are a lot of steps. And if you have a big table duplicating columns, mm, it might get slow. So I'm going to show you how to do this in one go. This is what we're going to do. We're going to duplicate this. I'm going to delete the previous steps. And this is what we're going to do. Here's the thing. What we need to do is to use text insert function and text insert function is actually quite an easy function it works like this you get a uh, text or a column and then you say where you want to insert something and then what you want to insert very easy okay so now that we know that we need to insert text on the existing column so how do i write that code it was like phew. i mean i would have to google it to be honest but what i normally do is like this i go to a function that knows that that's the same that is on the user interface. For example, here, when you click on the transform tab, this thing will do it on the existing column, which is what we want to do. So for example, extract, if I use extract text before delimiter, and then I write delimiter space, for example, it's not going to do anything, but it's going to give me the code that I need. The only thing I need to do is to actually extract. Instead of extract, I want to insert. So. I just need to modify this. I go in here, I write insert. This means for each row. Then I need, to, if you remember, it was the position what I want to insert stuff, which is two. And then the word that I want to insert, which is months. Ta da! How cool is this? So now we got the user interface help us write code and we could actually insert words in one go how about that for a video and all that in three minutes cool huh okay so this is over today enjoy this quick tip i'll see you again on wednesday and until then as always take care bye bye